the B stance deadlift, hold the dumbbell or kettlebell in one hand. Begin with your feet close together and whatever side is holding the weight, turn that side set of toes out directly to the side and then heel back and voila, you are in a B stance position. Now you can step your foot a little bit more out to the side or a little bit further back, just so long as you are not rotating through your hips and opening out to the side. So find the position that's comfortable for you. And please note, as we perform this, we're focusing on this front leg. This back foot is here as essentially a kickstand to help us balance. So from this side, toes out, heel back, find that kickstand balanced position with your hips squared off, pointing forward, shoulders squared off and shoulders down and back. Brace your core and keep a soft bend through your front knee. From here, we'll go into a hip hinge. Drive your hips back as you lower down, keeping the weight in close to you. Back remains flat. And now drive through this front foot and squeeze your glutes to stand up. Some common mistakes are to let the dumbbell hang way out in front of you, far from your legs. That forces you to round your back or keeping the dumbbell close, but then rounding your back anyway. We want the dumbbell close and our back flat. We also don't want an excessive arch through our back or a deep knee bend into a squat. Again, make sure that your hips and shoulders are squared off so that you're not opening out to the side or rotating your shoulders. So once more from the front, get into that B stance, keep that soft bend through your knee, hips back, hinging, inhale as you lower, exhale as you stand, driving through your front foot, squeezing your glutes in and up.